Hey there everyone, this is your host Scotty Oka and welcome back to Photo Mode Fast Forward Commentary Edition. As you can see, we are going to be messing with uh, none other than Peter Parker. And as you can see, uh, I am trying to get a pretty good angle on him. Um, now in this one, the one thing that's very important about this particular picture is the lighting. Otherwise, you're not going to get a very soulful picture. I don't know how to explain it. Um, but anyways, as you can see, I have got him at a kind of at an angle a little bit just so that way I can get a little bit more definition in his face. Did a little bit of a FOV, changing the focus so that way he is the main focus. Uh, it may not matter much because after I do some lighting stuff, you are not going to really see the background. Um, I'm going to do high action and blend it uh, to about 30, uh, 25. Uh, now with the lighting, now uh, a couple rules as always. One is that, uh, or one really important rule, no, 30 part, no third party software such as uh, GIMP or, um, or I can't think of the word right now. I almost said Spotify, but. I like using Spotify because uh, that's not visual, that's audio. Anyways, uh, as you can see, I'm messing with the light right now, and I have. Oh, no, come on. And also, too, these are also pre recorded. The videos are pre recorded, the audio is recorded after only because of time management on my end. I am horrible at time management. Um, as you can see, he is really washed out right now, but that will change, so no worries about that. As you can see, because of the way the light is, though, um, I turn all the, the exposure all the way down, which, again, gives him now more of a lifelike uh, feature, but that also completely uh, blacks out the background, which is fine for me. I, there's going to be a lot of those pictures I do take if you see my Twitter or, or Instagram. I like to have no uh, background, depending on the picture, because of how just, you know, uh, things are. There we go. Uh, as you can see, this definitely gives him more of a lifelike feel, just so that way he is, uh, you know, that way you can kind of see, like, the light in his eyes, essentially. Um, it makes, I don't know, I, I, I think it looks pretty good like that and I'm going to do a third one because um, I'm a fan of the three point system but instead of doing all three in the front I'm actually going to do the last one behind him and of course always do the spotlight if I can actually get it right there we go and um, turn the color intensity all the way to white softness all the way up and intensity all the way up now there we go um, it does kind of give a little bit of a weirdness to his hand. Hopefully, I mean, I noticed that after I made the picture, so I couldn't really do too much about that. Um, but, um, he actually looks, uh, pretty good, I think. Um, now this is just me kind of messing around, seeing if it would look any better or look pretty good in other positions. But also, too, I am double-checking my lights. It also gives you a good idea of where I have my lights. So if you want to try to create, recreate this picture, that's where everything's at. Or if you want to improve upon this picture, that's where all the lighting's at. Again, the lighting is so important in this picture. But anyways, uh, yeah, this is the picture I did for, uh, for this episode. So hopefully you all like it. And until then, everyone... I will catch you all later. Bye-bye!